So I have arrived in Singapore. Time to get some baggage, get a cab to the hotel, but it's way too early to check in. It's like 7 a.m. So I guess I get like a day to just roam around Singapore and see what's going on. So that's kind of cool. So I've dropped the bags at the hotel. It's 8 a.m. So it's time to go and get coffee somewhere because that's how we're going to have to start today and then hopefully have a little bit of time to explore. I don't know where yet, but we'll see. So this is going to be a quick trip. I am in Sunday morning. I have two talks tomorrow, morning and afternoon, and then I think we leave pretty much kind of lunch time on the Tuesday to go to Kuala Lumpur. So this is going to be a pretty short video probably, because uh, I'm just not here that long. But you know, I try and cram it all in. Managed to check in early, took a shower, feel human again, dressed more appropriately for the humidity and the weather. But for now I'm going to go and do a bit of touristing. It's about midday, so I'm just going to have a wander and see all of the weird buildings in Singapore. I have to be honest, there's like a really glorious absurdity to the architecture here. Like we, we couldn't get away with this in London, but I like that cities are building buildings like this. Most of the time, I would come here and then go and see people from the coffee industry, because that's what I'm doing, but the team from Simonelli's pretty stretched, there's stuff going on in Korea and here and everywhere else, so they just gave me a free day, which is kind of amazing. I mean, this whole deal is like a little overpriced and ridiculous, but when touristing, one should fully tourist. So I reckon I have one more coffee left in me today. Maybe some food could be good too. So I'm gonna walk up from here to a place I wanna visit called Nylon Coffee Roasters. Let's see what's going on there. I kinda of wanna know and I kinda of don't. I'm in the process of tracking down Nylon Coffee Roasters. They're here somewhere. Everyone there was just way too nice. Like, just way too nice. This is worth hunting out as a spot to drink coffee. It's a little bit hidden, and that's probably a good thing. I think it's cool. But um, that was a really good experience. Good morning. So I figure it's like 10 to 8, 8. I can walk 20 minutes, have coffee for 20 minutes, walk 20 minutes, get some exercise and have coffee and be ready to go by 9, which is the time that I'm getting picked up to head to the first session of the day at the San Gino offices. Uh, so I'm going to do a little TV interview. Wait. Did you cut the lock this? Well, I, I'm, I'm explaining now. Oh, like, uh, okay. that's okay. I'm getting in trouble because I'm not explaining what I'm doing. But you're going to ask me some questions. All right. Yeah? yeah. Who's asking? Me. You're going to ask me the questions. Yes. All right. Um, I'm going to be serious. I'm going to be serious now. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very you much. Time. Session two is done. Interview with Schmick TV is done, that's good. Uh, that's fun. I think now Charlize is gonna take us out for a little tour. I don't know where, but it's crab for dinner, I think, later. I'm getting close to the end of the trip, so it, it gets both easier and harder. Like, it's exciting to be going home soon, and I know I'm a little tired, but...
So this is a moon cake with lotus paste. Sweet. It's pretty sweet. Yeah. Like a little bit. Good morning. It's a little humid again. It's a little hot again. I'm in Singapore for like the morning only. We're going to get some coffee, get some breakfast. It is a humid day. Back at the hotel before uh, heading to the airport. Everyone was super nice this morning. Thanks for Leon for showing me around. Um, also great to see Dennis and Jamin from uh, Nylon. People are too friendly here, it's crazy. It's like a less salty Bukhari sweat. Got like an hour to kill in the lounge. Until we play the Kuala Lumpur. And that is the end of Singapore. Which is sad because I want to come back.